Hey everyone, happy Saturday, it's Jessica. Today is October 16th, Saturday. I have a lot of daily, weekly vlogs to still upload to my channel, but those are still taking time to upload, so I thought it'd be nice to post this video first and make a update video on how my life has been in South Korea so far. And I thought it'd be fun to do this while doing my makeup. So let's do this. I just want to share like a new item I bought from G Market. This is an eyeshadow palette and it's so pretty. It's like a tweed, it's like a tweed design and it looks like a little diary but when you open it, it's actually an eyeshadow palette and it's like the cutest eyeshadow palette I've ever owned it's so pretty and this is what the colors look like I'm just gonna be applying this to my face today I already did my face makeup and my eyebrows I'm just gonna be using this little mirror that the eyeshadow palette came with to look at myself today I'm just gonna head down to Seoul because I have a appointment and the weather has been getting colder so I wore this top that I bought from Express Bus Terminal and I'm wearing a long skirt that I bought from Hot Pink I bought it while I was still in America and I posted a haul on that. I will link it somewhere up here, but this skirt is great for this weather and it feels really good quality. So watch that video. And if you're interested, I believe I have it linked in that video description box. My voice is kind of gone because I've been speaking and using my voice all week due to my job if you don't know, I'm here as an English teacher so I've been using my voice a lot and my voice is a little strained it doesn't hurt anymore because I think the muscles have gotten stronger and I can now use my voice more without it hurting but I think I am losing my voice so I'm gonna try to not talk as much also if you're not following me on my Instagram which I will put here you probably missed that I dyed my hair like two weeks ago and I did the secret two-tone hair so this is what my hair looks like it was more on the grayish violet side like right when I dyed it but after each wash it's been fading into like some beigey color which I still really like and the reason why I chose this kind of hair design is because I wanted something low maintenance because I am quite busy I've been quite busy since arriving to Korea. So first, let me use my eyeshadow palette. I'm just going to use my fingers for this. And I'll use the first color, Puff Crop Top. And the color looks like this. Overall, I think my weekends in Korea have been quite productive. I've definitely been going out every weekend which I'm usually a homebody but because I'm in Korea for a limited amount of time I wanted to make the most out of my time here next I'll be using the check pleats color right here and I really like how the color payoff is for this palette this palette is from Espoir and it's the lookbook palette. It's limited edition and I just saw it on G Market. I thought it was so pretty so I had to buy it. This one's called Roko High Teen. And the color palette's just up my alley so I had to get it. Anyways, I've been super busy with my job and everything. I haven't had much time for editing on YouTube which I feel like I'm, I should get back into no matter how busy I am because I truly really love making YouTube videos I think my eyeshadow color is a little too 
too light so I'm gonna add in knee-high socks she looks like this I love how the payout is for this palette it's so it doesn't feel chalky it's it's like pretty smooth when it transfers to your skin and the color payoff is really good as well so if you do happen to see Espoir eyeshadow palettes especially this one I think I'd recommend this it's also my first impression and oh this color is gorgeous it's gorgeous I'm just using my fingers because it's easy I'm sure a lot of us are like that oh yes I love this color but that was my eyeshadow I'm gonna grab a tissue anyways if anyone is curious where I did my hair I'll put the name of the salon here and I think I'll have a vlog coming up it, it should be in like a life in Korea sort of vlog coming up soon on my channel and I'll just show you like kind of little clips here and there that I took while in Korea and I definitely have included clips of me at the hair salon next I'm going to go in with a eyeliner these days to speed up my eyeliner game I just line the very ends of my eyes to elongate it rather than lining the whole eye line just because I have hooded eyes it takes a long time to do eyeliner each time and I just wanted to save time by doing this I think this eyeliner is a no-go right now because I believe it's drying out so I'm just gonna go in with a different eyeliner this one is my Kat Von D tattoo liner in the color Mad Max Brown I didn't realize that this ran out of ink I'll try to get the life out of this on a different day but for now I'll just switch eyeliners oh yeah this one's great and do the same for the other side my right eye is honestly more hooded than the left side you can definitely see a stronger crease on the left so my eyes are not only hooded but they're also uneven so I have to be careful when lining both eyes I have to make sure they're even I have to line my eyes if I do the half liner method then I have to keep my eyes open when I line it um so my eyeliner i kind of messed up okay i definitely messed up my eye makeup but i think i still look okay so i'll just end it there yeah so a lot of you asked me how my life has been in korea and i just want to say that working in korea has been kind of difficult for me I'm telling myself that I'm proud because I am definitely doing my best every day. I hope I don't get burnt out. So now I'm just gonna use my new Bia lipstick. This is the Bia Last Powder lipstick. This is number 10, Cream Rose. This is what Cream Rose looks like. It's a really gorgeous color. And like, I feel like it really matches with the makeup. But I'm just gonna add a little bit more because I did buy a second color. And this is the number six Just Feel color of the same line. I bought it because it was on G Market and it was there was a promotion like buy one get one. So this is the other color, number 6, and I'm just going to apply this towards the center. And I like this color because it really defines like my lips. And also, I like the powdery finish of these two lipsticks. So that's the makeup I'm going to keep it at for now. 
I might fix it later, but I feel like I couldn't do my eye makeup as well because I'm using a small mirror. But anyways, thank you for watching this video. I hope you have a great day and I hope you like this kind of video. Do let me know what kind of videos you want to see from me in the future. I will do my best to make them. And I am not missing from YouTube. I've just been a little bit busy, but I will definitely create more content for you all in the coming weeks. So stay tuned for that. And see you next time. Bye!